আসসালামু আলাইকুম এভরিওয়ান আই হোপ এভরিবডি ইজ সেফ বিকজ অফ দ্য ভাইরাস ইউ নো এভরি হার স্প্রেডিং করোনা ভাইরাস এভরি কান্ট্রি ইজ নট গো নট ইন আ গুড সিচুয়েশন ইন দিস মোমেন্ট সো উই আর ডুইং সাম কাইন্ডস অফ কোয়ারেন্টাইন we are trying to we will try to stay at home at this moment and pray to the god uh for everything uh pray to god so that everything will be fine soon so today i'm gonna show you how to recently i have created this app for one of my clients so it was all about kind of uh flight booking app so i made some kinds of simple interaction for my client like i'm going to show you how it works so fine you see this is very cool very simple so everything i made inside the xt so some kinds of things so like this so, so today i will show you how to create this simple interaction on boarding interaction for uh, so let's open a new file i already open here yeah you can see this is this is what i'm going to do show you for now very simple very easy and very effective don't need to be worry about this so it's not too complicated like when we do animation with after effect very easy just you need to think about the final result where we will we want it to come so our final let's say our final result is this logo so we can make very cool simple animation for this so for uh we need to copy this artboard because you know this after effect this uh, adobe xd is work artboard by artboard animation not, not like timeline animation so we'll come this place so i'm going to just disorder these steps this here you here you here you here mm just on the them a bit cool so now i will make go to prototype just create a new link okay <laughs> i'm keeping this one second and i will this type action type is auto and i will have easy in out check in probably 1 second or 0.8 second that's it so when user will come from here to here will show the when user see this step so this screen there will be nothing so i'm going to just remove this part nothing is here let's play the steps cool mm. that was checked actually i don't want to go from here to here without any kinds of interaction so i made another kinds of i'm just removing this link for now i will show you how can i animate this part in this screen without creating any new artboard so i'm going to copy this part from here okay i will make some interaction between this text and between this part of the illustration so I'm, i copied that paste them here for now i will just keep him off so that i can work with this bit a lot so i want my card 
to from here to coming in, in this place also probably I can change him a bit like uh, this so that he will give a uh, kind of a small kinds of interaction okay I can make my no okay for this okay and him a bit a little bit squeezing so whatever you want you can change but the final result will be like this that's the magic of creating simple interaction with Adobe XD I'm going here my clouds clouds uh, will come like this 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 or oh, he'll come from this and probably this bird is will come from here a little bit excusing mm, probably he, he also no no I don't wanna move him so this is okay and for text this is he will come from here he will come from here so everything so now I'm gonna what I will do I will just okay you have to name them to poly just move them so I don't need to be bothered with them anymore I just opening my oh, um, sorry okay I just opening my logo here because he was here so let's let's link him okay still I don't want any kinds of tapping interaction I want timing interaction here because uh, my splash screen will open then it will automatically re redirect from here to here after 1.8 seconds let's check the result for now play from the wow cool do you like it I'm gonna play him again a bit mm. or as we will not going like we are not sw swiping anything probably I will just not animate this part like like the part of text because it's it's too much for me I think so I'm gonna just keeping him I can just what I can do I can just reduce the opacity a bit so that he will just appear here everything will be like that way okay let's play him this again let's check the result now uh oh I forget to link them because I was undoing the results so I need to link it again mm -hmm. let's check cool I think this is nice more nice so oh, you can make lots of like you can just if you want to play with your buttons and steps you can just create a piece few things like this way like you, you they can come from a little bit bottom so you can just play whatever you want you know yeah you see how they came from that bottom part now uh, okay so for this the same thing I will do I'll just copy them my these two things here I will go here for now what I can do I can okay I can just keep them off a bit my text too and the group this group because I will I need to play with these steps my this stuff so they will come from here he will come from here probably he will go up or oh, okay the background so he will go up from here um, mm -hmm. okay they will come from the top and they will he will be going up probably he can just remove from like this um, 
do also like this okay probably like this and obviously my clouds will be come from different places now I will just remove them too as well my text and my this group and I will bring them up uh -oh. okay no not visual interlining I want him here why there are two text same text okay probably previously I have I had this copied because making them again mm -hmm. Where is this? From where he came. So I am gonna delete him again. So I'm gonna remove them. What happened actually previously? I had something here like from my when I made my previous parts. So that's why they are here. So I'm gonna for now I will click this part and I will go here. Mm -hmm. Let's check a bit, please. So this will tap auto animate is in out probably a little bit lower less the interaction time. So nice. What do you think? So I have to create the link back link because okay you know that this is a swiping effect. So I can do this making swiping but I want him to go back to whenever that he's I'm clicking here just to show. Not like okay, this we should you sh we should go back. I should have a back button here. Actually, so I make this kind of swiping action. That's why. So I can click here and come to here as well. The same thing like. So let me check again what happened if I come here, go back. Hmm. Cool. Do you like it? I think I like it a lot. The next part, next part I will do the same things. Like I'm going I need to copy these two text, text three and group one six zero. I think I I already copy here, so I'm gonna remove them from there as well. I did actually. I I can just show that what I did the same process I did, so I don't need to show you again and again. So I. Mm, for now I'm gonna just keeping keep keeping them off a bit text I'm gonna show you what I did here like bringing them up so I made the same kinds of things like but I want actually here and from here okay so I made just little bit change of this element and this element so same things so the type I need to bring them off and I need to bring my component form this part is on like this element and this element okay so whenever I'm clicking next I will be coming here okay whenever I'm coming back going back so I'm almost done, uh, done the steps so I can have a same, same things like this mm -hmm. Let me check from the from the beginning. Okay. Mm -hmm. You see, you see. Did you like it? So whenever we we'll click get list started, we will have the our login screen. Thank you for staying with me.